Okay, we're gonna take a look at the interior here of the 322 Monterey. As you see, there's plenty of room there at the dinette. That also collapses down to make a bed. There's a full size bed in the front with a skylight. All the windows still have the original screens. It does have an AC and heater built into the boat. Built-in coffee maker. As you can see, plenty of storage in the kitchen. Microwave and outlet. We've also got the recess under mount paper towel holder. Refrigerator. Again, everything works. Boat is primarily being used for storage. The sink has multiple ways it can be used. You can remove this or put it back to make additional counter space. Then you have this garage storage here. Then over here we have a cedar lined closet. It's full length, it actually goes down inside. This is where, as you can see, the amplifiers mounted. It's got an upgraded Clarion stereo. That's AM, FM, Bluetooth, and USB. This is where all the controls are. For our generator, we're gonna turn on the entry lights and the cabin lights right now. So you can see, and everything works. We have the entry lights there and then back here. Two berths and these, can, these will connect to make one large berth so you can sleep three people in the back. There's also a 110 outlet that's mounted here on the side of the nightstand. And as you see, a, a port window. Storage. There's storage underneath these bunks on both sides. The storage underneath the sink here is quite large. Then you have the three drawers. You can see the undermount light here, the rope lighting. There's storage underneath the uh, dinette. And then over here was a cabinet for the TV that we no longer have, but you can place it with something. There's an outlet as well as the cable connection. And then we have the bath. It's a vacuum flush toilet. Can be converted to a shower. Mounts up top. And the drain is in the far corner here of the floor. So it can be used as a shower with a built-in teak seat. That flips up. As you can see, everything is in good shape. So that is the interior here of the 322 Monterey. Okay, we have the 322 Monterey Cruiser here walking in from the back. You've got three access hatches to access your two engines and your generator set that's in the center. Under seat storage. With your shore connect, power on, power off switches. All the upholstery has been redone back in 2016. So the interior was upgraded, redone, and the HydroTurf sea deck flooring laid on the interior here. You have storage here for trash and other things. As you can see, the five stainless steel cup holders. And we have multiple speakers built in the arch with LED lights. All wrapped in a soft vinyl upholstery. As you can see, the bimini top is basically brand new by Sombrella. All the instrument clusters, gauges have been replaced and upgraded. We now have the Garmin. It's 
maps and fish locator built into one. Your main lights and breakers right here on the dash. Tabs. Your windless anchor. Your built-in Clarion remote. This here, the white remote, actually controls the LED lights, which we'll have to show you at night, that control all the different colors. As you can see, the Hydro Durf comes all the way up to the front, and even the front bow cushion has been rewrapped in the new vinyl. The windlass up on the front of the tongue. We have storage here underneath the sink. And as you can see, we just kind of keep some general items underneath here. You have another little cutty right here. Air horns mounted on the side. The, those were added in custom as well. Side little compartment here. Keep things like rope. There's that port window that goes down to the uh, beneath bunk. And then this seat flips up for additional storage. You can see we're keeping ropes and light vests. Otherwise, the helm seat does adjust forward and has the flip down, flip up bolster. All the stitching was custom made and to replicate the original upholstery on the boat. Again, it's all brand new as of four years ago. That's the exterior of the 322. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and take off the engine hatches here. I've got the one off already. So we're gonna come on back here to the back and open up the center. All three hatches technically open up. You just have to remove the support here to the seat and you can get all three open here. So it reveals you've got your twin engines here. They're 5.7 Mercury's and you've got a 5.0 KW generator. The generator does have its own battery. There's two house batteries and independent batteries for each engine. As you can see, we've added a dewinterizing de service here that uh, has individual valves for every pet cock on both motors. So you simply just open each one of those valves and it drains into the bilge. Over here is your water heater. And as you can see, the engine bay, for the most part, is very clean. Something to mention here on the 322 Monterey is these custom-built ladder. And then also the storage on the back platform here, as well as back here. And it goes in all the way the length of the seat there. And it also comes back here to the left. So there's plenty of storage. You've got the city water hookup right here. You got four storage locations for bumpers that fit in there nicely. You got the rear transom wash down, hot and cold. And then obviously the remote for the Clarion player. Now the fuel, there's fuel fill on both sides of the boat up here on the transom and then you got the water to fill the tanks.